Hello, day five in quarantine. It's definitely day five today. Uh, everything's gone to poo and we've had a bad day <coughs> because I've been super sick. It's just a head cold, kids head cold. I'm not feeling so bad now, but this morning, uh, um, yeah, difficult to stay awake and really tired and weak. But feeling better now. And the kids are better, getting better, much better. So we got to go out into the sunshine. And that was lovely. And then I had to work for four hours this evening, which was very difficult. And I had to leave the kids kind of basically watching TV and raiding the cupboards. So I think for dinner that you had crisps and um, biscuits. Can you not pick your nose, please, on camera? <laughs> Thank you. Did you raid the chocolate? No. Good girl. Well, we, only something. we only had pudding, chocolate. You had pudding and crisps for dinner. Good. Well, at least it's a balanced meal. Um, short video because we're just not up to it. Um, shout out to all the kids and the mums and dads of the kids who went back to school this week in the UK. It's, um, I'm sure it's a difficult and unsettling time for you all and I hope everything's going well. And, um, oh yeah, we got a call from Anna's and Milo's school to say, where are the children? And I said, they're in Australia. So, um, and I did inform them, but I don't know if I'm supposed to do something else, but hey, they can't find me because I'm not there. And, um, yeah, it was a great school. They, the um, finance manager and the deputy principal regularly get in their cars and go and collect kids that are um, regular absentees. So, Kay, Amy, if you fancy a drive... Come on out to Australia and correct, collect them. They're ready for you. They're waiting. <laughs> you can have them. <laughs> uh, Milo's asleep. Anna was asleep and she's now woken up. And she's now going back to bed. Night, night. Say night, night. Ah.